But today we're talking uh, hoses. We're talking in particular the uh, track and trace in 316 that we have here. It's got a copper wire running through it so that you can use your 5 watt transmitter through the hose so that the hose is traceable in the drain. We've set it to 33 kilohertz and we've pumped up the uh, the power on this thing to send it through there. You can either do it with the scout locator or you can use the SR20. Uh, so if you're using the scout locator, you want to turn it on and set the frequency to 33 kilohertz, which you'll see I've already set it there and turn off the rest of the frequencies. And you want a bit of volume, I'll turn it down a bit so you can hear what I'm saying. Then when you're going over the over the hose in the drain, you're looking for the highest numbers here. So if those numbers start dropping back off again, then you've gone too far. So you want them that nice sound and the highest numbers. And you can see that line in the middle that's showing us. Once you get on there, you can twist a bit, it'll tell you the depth. You can push down and also force the depth and it'll tell you. So that's how you do it with the scout, just over, so you're getting the highest numbers. If you want to use the SR20, that'll make life a lot easier for you. This guy's got a few more sensors on it, and it really shows you really well where that line is. So when you're following, you can go, yep. So yeah, SR20 is good investment, and if you want track and trace, trace lines, you can use this white track and trace hose.